Now to more controversy on the campus of Michigan State University. Dr. Rima Vassar is stepping down from her role as chair of the MSU Board of Trustees. However, she will stay on as a trustee. Vassar's resignation comes amid allegations of bullying outlined in a report that refers to advice Vassar and fellow trustee Dennis Denno allegedly gave students to attack and embarrass their colleagues. Well, tonight, a student who says she felt exploited by those two trustees is breaking her silence, talking to seven investigator Ross Jones. I realized that my involvement with trustee Vassar and Denno has been kind of used in a way to harm others. Saba Saad is a fourth year MSU student who said she met trustees Rima Vassar and Dennis Denno last fall. It was around the same time MSU's Board of Trustees came under fire after trustee Brianna Scott released a letter saying Vassar bullied interim president Teresa Woodruff, overstepped her authority, and violated the board's ethics policies. So after that meeting, Chair Vassar had came up to me and talked to me, and so the trustee Denno thanking me for what I did, and that's when we set up a meeting. Saad is Palestinian and says she thought meeting with Vassar and Denno would help bring attention to the struggles of Arab students. She was hopeful, but before long said she felt like the trustees were merely exploiting her. It was very transactional. It was just fueling the anger that we had because of everything that's going on, exploiting it for their own good. That's backed up by the findings in this independent investigation by a third-party law firm hired to investigate trustee Scott's claims against Vassar. In meetings that Saad said she recorded, Chair Vassar was heard telling students to protest interim president Teresa Woodruff. There's so many other groups that you could partner with to crucify her, she said. Denna was heard telling students, embarrass Woodruff. Tell her you're working with Black Student Alliance, whether you are or not. That will terrify her. At one point, the report says Denno discussed shirts that said, hashtag not a Spartan, that students could wear to meet with Woodruff. It says Denno offered to pay for the shirts, but asked the students to keep his name out of it. Oh, you didn't want your name on it because you didn't want to know that you're encouraging students to come to these meetings, shouting out they're not a Spartan and calling out these individuals. Ultimately, Saad says she felt used by Vassar and Denno, exploiting hers and other students' causes to weaponize them against their enemies and MSU. It's exploitation of our issues and don't use the fact that the university has failed the Arab community as a way to say it has failed you when you failed us. And that was Ross Jones reporting. Both Vassar and Denau said yesterday they disagree with some of the findings of that third party investigation with Denau saying he was targeted. Both said they have consistently stood up for marginalized communities like Arab American and black students.